Welcome back to the Gaping Monumental Association of Wrestling. That's Gaping Mars Saturday Night's World Nation. I'm Ken Brackle. Before we go, just a reminder, tune in next week to Ruptured Spleen Revenge with Flying Elbowino versus the Embalmers. But now, what we've all been waiting for, the winner of our Constitute Teacher Contest is Pepper Ann Pearson of Hazelnut, USA! Pepper Ann! Pepper Ann! Pepper Ann! Yes, yes, yes! Yes! Pepper Ann Pearson gets to have her least favorite teacher sent a lovely Aruba for two weeks! While gaping Maw champion Mama Destructo takes over the class. Best of all, Mama Destructo will be residing at the Pearson house throughout her stay. What? Pearson, I am preemptively issuing you detention slips for the rest of the year. Huh? Pop quiz, Pepper Ann. Recite the numbers in pi. You fail! See you in summer school. Well, hold on, because I'm gonna, um, make you clap erasers. Or unbend paper clips. Or eat stew. What can I do to be the least favorite teacher? What? Oh, you guys want to win the trip. I can't choose. You're all my least favorite. I'll pick a name out of the hat or something. Uh, the winner of the fabulous two-week Aruba vacation is... Ms. Duck. Finally, the wheel of fate spins in Abriola's favor. In your pace, Roland. Tell Mama to enjoy teaching math. I'm off to get my groove back. Amazing thing. Students and teachers, please give it up for the grand dam of the abdominal suit. People have asked me why I agreed to this Tustitute teacher contest. The answer is Miss Elaine Engelbritson. Who's Miss Elaine Engelbritson? My sixth grade teacher. Without her, Mama Destructor would have just been a large, badly quaffed lump of wasted potential and ignorance. And let me tell you something, ignorance. I will defeat you. I'm gonna twist you into a figure four leg lock and send you crying to your papa. You're gonna go into my classroom and get embarrassed. Just try something, ignorance. Just try it. enjoys TV? Who enjoys auto travel or packages sold by weight, not volume? Well, none of these things would be possible without mathematics. <gasps> From now on, call me Mama Instructo. Let's get it on. X equals three Try one. Uh, okay, but, but, but I'm pretty sure X equals a, a three, Mama Destructo. Instructo. And it's time for some instructing. Oh, yeah. Ha! Um, what are you doing? Listen up, people. There are rules to this class. If I throw a wrestler move down on you, you gotta react just like in the ring or on a talk show. 
Let's just not try it at home, huh? Now, Constance, I'm gonna throw you a fake blind elbow. You toss your head back, and you groan in agony. Okay. Time for some instructing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Good job on the head throw. But horrible, horrible math. Sit down. Now, where did she go wrong? I have no idea. But I do know that 8 times 5 equals 42, so X has to equal 1. <laughs> Eight times five equals 40. You want a bowl of pain from Mama's kitchen? Now what's eight times five? Eight times five equals... Ooh, 42? So she's a little rusty with the multiplication tables, but... Rusty with the multiplication tables? She's a math teacher! A teacher vested with the sacred task of shaping the very mathematical future of this land. Eight times five equals forty. Two. Two. Excuse me. You want me to hold your hair? <laughs> I tell you, during that match, we all found out why knees are not supposed to bend that way. <laughs> Mama, you're a guest. Now you just stop working this in. No! Oh, Mama always does her part. Okay. I'll go get the ketchup tureen. I'm glad you won the contest, Pepper Ann. I love Hazelnut Middle School. You know, I came up with the Tufstitute Teacher Contest. Really? Mm-hmm. Miss Ingelbritson. She knew her stuff backwards and forwards, and she knew how to cram it into our heads. I hope I can be half the teacher she was. Oh, you are. You're a good teacher. Ow. Eight times five equals... Forty-two! We all know that six times six equals 39, right? So... Um, excuse me, Mama. May I be excused? Sorry, but I can't wait for you to get back. This is a very important lesson why you should never divide any number by more than 15. Oh, listen to me. Your math is making me violently ill. Listen to me! If you want to stick your head out the window, then have at it! You are no friend to education. So, why you should never divide anything by Ooh. 50? I said out the window, little. Out the window! Moose! Pappy! Mama Distracto! Dinner! You gotta say something to Mama. About what? Come on, she teaches wrong math and she doesn't even do it well. When people mess up, she puts them in screaming headlocks. She may be one of your heroes, but she's not a math teacher. <sighs> okay. Okay. I brought her into HMS. I guess I gotta be the one to take her out. Mama, please pass the ambrosia. Thank you. Equals 305! Like that? Yes! Great soul slam reaction! You're really coming along. But learn your Pythagorean theorem! Three angles of a right angle triangle equal 430! 180! They equal 180! You're wrong! You asked for it, little. You can't body slam the truth, Mama! That's it, Missy. To Principal Hickey's office. If you're not gonna abide the rules of this class and throw your head back and fake scream, you're out of here! Gladly. What's the matter, kid? Well, uh, there's someone I need to stand up to. But I can't. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe it. 
Someone as scrappy as you not being able to stand up to someone? You think I'm scrappy? Dang straight. And scrappy is a scrappy do. Do it. Stand up to this person. The strength is inside you. I know it. So can you do it? Can you? Yes. You're a horrible teacher. You teach math wrong. And you're impatient. And you don't know how to add. <sighs> I am so glad to get that off my chest. Huh? Mama? Mama? Mama distract. I mean, Mama Instructor, wait! My mom told me that you were here. Where are you going? I'm going to join the Some Body Slam to Love Tour. I'm no teacher. It was a stupid dream. It wasn't stupid. Come with me. I need to show you something. Guys. What you taught us. I was wrong. You're a good teacher, Mama Instructo. It's math that isn't your strong point, but wrestling is. When you've taught us about that, you've been great. Give up math, but don't give up your dreams of being a teacher. But I treated Nikki so badly, and all she was doing was sticking up for math. Sure, but she bears no ill will. Do you really think I can teach? So, will you stay? No, but I'll see you soon. Two, three, good. Just try to arch your back more when you're doing a swing buster. It'll give you more leverage. Mama thought she had to be in a classroom to make her dreams of teaching come true. When all along, all she had to do was stay in the ring. Uh -huh. Next match, Nikki Little versus Shelf McLean. Take him, Nikki. Give the shelf a call and her a pain. Come on, Nikki, let's go. He